she's just mad because her wig's stale. She just mad because her wig's stale and she ain't got no edges. Too bad. <laughs> Welcome back to Nini's Planet. How are you guys doing? What's Gucci? What's Liddy? What's Poppington? Welcome back to another episode of Love and Hip Hop Del So Valley. We're back. We're back. We're back. And y'all, I loaded in this game and there is tea all ready. We got to get into this. By the way, if you do not know, if you want to win a $25 Amazon gift card, I'm doing a giveaway in celebration of me hitting 30k. So the link will be in the description box if you want to go enter that and things of that sort. Okay. So in the beginning, of course, you guys saw that little speed through of me giving Keisha a new outfit. Like, I mean, it's cute because the jeans are supposed to be big and baggy like that. So it's just kind of like worked out because she's pregnant so she is just down here chilling oh Najee done earned four hundred dollars okay y'all let me get into the tea okay let's switch over to Darian so Mr. Darian <laughs> So if you guys know, Darian was messing around with Anika and of course he got Anika pregnant. To Darian, Brittany doesn't know, but Brittany knows, but he does he hasn't like came across Brittany to like tell her and stuff. But we gonna get into that later. Okay. So Darian, we all knew this was coming, right? We all knew this was coming. It is notorious in my game. I Is there a way for my Sims to like get a treatment or something for them to be like immune to the crabs? Cause like, listen, it can get overwhelming. And then I saw the toilet thing. I saw the toilet thing right here. And I'm just like, Darian don't gotta use the bathroom. Like he's good. So I went over it and y'all look at this burning from undiagnosed problems something is definitely very wrong the constant need to pee has gotten unbearable it burns there's even traces of ooh, it could be that or a wtd most certainly darian needs to see a doctor okay so y'all darian done caught something he is a dirty dirty sausage guy listen y'all know what i would have said in place of that but i can't say it so he is a dirty sausage guy all right i also noticed something different i did update my game and i updated my mods so uh right here it says relationship wellness go to the doctor if you click on any other males in here they don't have that option it just says go get tested that is how i knew something was wrong with darian we gotta make sure nika doesn't have anything either oh my goodness darian ew Eh, you just out here raw dogging everybody this is what you get Najee got a concert i'm gonna go ahead and send him um send him on his concert by himself so we can keep getting this coin so uh start a concert away i will cheat his hunger okay seven is up there cooking lord uh, 
Ew, Zarian. I'm sorry. If y'all hear sniffling, I am a little stopped up, sick, whatever. While he's gone, we're going to go ahead and focus on everybody else. So Najee is going to go uh, do his concert. He will be back in a little bit. Brittany. <sighs> Brittany, Brittany, Brittany. I don't know what I want to do with my good sis, Brittany. It's like, it's karma because she went behind Darian's back. But it's just like, girl, you kind of deserve it too. Like, you know, like, I'm kind of iffy about it. I'm kind of iffy about her, like, how she would feel about this. But at the same time, listen, she shouldn't even care because the last episode she found out he got another girl pregnant. So she's probably, she probably won't even care. Okay, Seven, how you doing, girl? What's this? Ooh! Seven is on birth control. I didn't make her do that. Okay, Seven. You out here being smart with it. Period. Oh, my God. Seven's not even a celebrity no more. No, 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 no. We got we to gotta work on that. She's not even a celebrity no more. What the heck? Y'all, we got to work on her audition stuff. I feel so bad because we had sent her on that audition for her acting and we didn't even get to go with her and stuff go ahead and um girl are you stuck <laughs> seven okay oh he got his ten thousand mm. dollars go ahead and uh do that so you got an audition tomorrow okay that's good finish cooking that so are you almost finished <gasps> he's back oh he has a uti oh okay oh now daria knows what the problem is better take the prescribed medications all this out is coke what do you mean medications i Darian, like I said, Darian doesn't know that Brittany knows. So we're going to go ahead and uh, tell Brittany that we got. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, this shit is new. This is new. Ooh. Confess loving another. <gasps> okay, we can confess. Okay, what else can we do? Express suspicions about closeness with Naji about Britney oh oh listen this update yes just yes okay this update alternative pregnancies discuss having a baby through a surrogate artificial instead y'all better go get this update go get this update the woohoo wellness and pregnancy mod update go get it okay so first of all i i, I do i just want to know like how where is that little option to where you tell them you have uh, a wtd okay i guess you can't tell them but you know what let's go ahead and confess to Brittany that we we kind of got another girl pregnant so go ahead and do that she has to use bathroom though we got to get some lice shampoo though so we can get rid of this lice but dang he has a uti but like you can't get what medication crack I, how you getting mad at her when you telling her that you cheated i'm lost oh ooh. she was like okay so now you want to tell me i already knew because she came through and told me oh britney's partner confessed that they're in love with someone else i mean not okay and love is a stretch um slept with yes what should britney do stay and try to reconquer their love or end the relationship no 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 go ahead and end the relationship it's it's all good especially since you got homegirl pregnant uh-uh bye we're good okay so darian and britney just broke up oh he's he's mad how is he mad he has the audacity dumped from breaking up getting dumped really gets a hot head and some riled up he has the i told y'all he's narcissistic like how are you mad when you all right now she going straight over to naji yikes okay so darian and britney has broken up now let's see if we can have him beg for forgiveness are you able to go beg for forgiveness it might be too it's too early on she won't accept it and i wouldn't want her to accept it don't do it period 
where is Keisha? Keisha, ooh, Keisha. So, y'all, I decided I'm gonna let Keisha have the babies. Yes, babies. I totally forgot it was two girls. <laughs> but yeah, I'm. I'm. I decided I'm gonna let her have them. Um, but this story will change in a little bit. But yeah, she is going to go through and keep the babies because you know how there's that storyline where the women feel like because they got a baby by the person they think that's gonna keep the person around that's this situation right here so Keisha thinks that because she's giving him twins and even though he doesn't want them he's still around he hasn't told her like he wants to break up or anything like that she thinks that he still you know has a little bit of some type of like love in his heart about her and um maybe the kids so she's just blind right now y'all she's just blind but what she is gonna do though in secret of course he's gonna find out at some point but so what we are gonna do you guys we are gonna go ahead and come over here and we're gonna go to mc command center settings money pay child support okay unmarried they are not married um child support percent oof 500 all right yeah we're gonna keep it at 500 percent because listen Najee bringing in all this money he should definitely have enough to pay child support are y'all all talking in cahoots this is awkward oh she said girl you have the audacity you have the audacity let's go ahead and rub it in her face let's rub it in her face that her and her man broke up kind of like aha that's what you get karma but girl keisha please oh girl don't get to listen keisha coming back don't play keisha got that pregnancy meanness okay don't try it let's be petty and shove her because obviously she can't hit her back so like go ahead shove her mm -hmm. ain't nothing yo <gasps> oh she said i can't hit you but i could throw a drink at you oh i hope y'all don't fight please don't fight y'all darian is really tight right now like he is tight i don't even is this the highest the anger can go because he yikes like if he dies i i don't know if i'm gonna i'm gonna be real i don't know if i'm gonna save him or not but girl not you sleep in the damn hot tub get you know what you know what you could do seven come down here and work out <sighs> seven is giving unproblematic like she's the only one that's been unproblematic in this household lately so okay so go over there and work out my good sis look at them they were just flirting oh my god why are you coming down here to talk to seven by yourself i don't like that you better just be having a normal conversation with her now you already messy like don't be trying to lure seven into your shenanigans seven is better than that and she won't fall for it y'all i'm gonna have to watch this back because when did this happen when did that happen i literally just said seven was better than that and then you oh not anika asking to go out on a date at the photo studio you know what go ahead and go okay so here we are at the photo studio why did you show up naked you was ready i guess oh my god all right so how do we tell anika oh now he being mean to her <gasps> this is not the first thing that you do yo he really went on the date just to be like this is all your fault this all your fault if you hadn't got pregnant i wouldn't be in this mess with my girl Brittany. wow why would he do that you know what question being the father go question being the father at this point he don't even think he the father he don't even think he the father like she too cute to not be messing around with other people that's what he thinks so am i really am i really the father i don't think i am at this point like darian is just taking his anger out on anika like please what is wrong with you we just wanted to go out for the day like what is why is he like this look he just he, he, he just stop shouting for better words look at that rile up don't yo don't make her lose this baby don't do it look anika not having that 
He better not make her lose this baby, I swear. Darian's lover says Darian is the father of the child. This is not a serious relationship, nothing official. A pregnancy was not intended and Darian doesn't know what to do about it. Follow the call of responsibility and develop this relationship further. Make this a hit and run, something in between. Darian is still too shocked to even think. Could it be Darian's lover is wrong? Should they check? Okay, so he's feeling a little skeptical oh he could deny it he's so angry that he could deny not being the father oh my lord go ahead and do that i really i just told you i don't think i'm the father i don't think i am anika is just like okay you think that's the case let's go do a paternity test poor anika darren is putting her through so much like huh he better not make her lose this child i swear i will literally make my sim self come in to save and fight him like <laughs> he better not so y'all need to go do this paternity test and come back with these damn results okay oh god anika no oh okay so darian is hella stressed tragedy Darian hopes so badly that this child was not his, only to have the truth slap him in the face. But Anika, Anika ain't so happy about that one. Oh my gosh. He can either do this final decision of rejecting Anika's child or telling Anika that, okay, we'll step up and be the father. Y'all, this will really like determine a lot when it comes to Darian being in Anika's life and stuff like that so should Darian reject the child and not be in the child's life or should he try to step up to the plate and be like okay whatever you done already proved I'm the dad okay let me know let me know so I this was supposed to be a whole day I feel hella bad for Anika. He done really just came over here and just ruined her day. Let's try and calm her down. Let's try and calm her down. He's a little, he has like some mixed, ooh, 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 it's not working. Oh, it worked. It actually worked. Oh, she's stressed now. Look what you doing to her. Okay, they are overheating. I don't want nobody to die of heat. So listen, go. Uh-uh, uh-uh, we don't need Anika dying. Go ahead and go home. Why are y'all embarrassed? Okay, Darian is back. Um, He is hella stressed. I'm trying to figure out why was Kyron embarrassed? What happened? Did he do something he shouldn't have did? Is that what happened? I don't know what happened. Najee is over here cooking. I can't believe that Najee was even flirting with Seven. Seven, I... I I thought you were better than this girl. I really did. Because I really thought Seven was just above the bull crap. But apparently not. She fed into his madness as well. I want them to have a party low key. Uh, invite all the people that they know. Or just like a little get together. We don't really know a lot of people. But a little get together sounds fun. Why the heck are y'all being mean? Oh my god. Not y'all being mean to each other. Ooh. Okay, so because of the fact that Najee said something petty to Brittany, I don't know why. I don't even know why he did that. But Brittany's moodless said, this sim got one more time, one more time to disrespect me. After that, we throwing hands. That's it. We not even on that level for them to think that was cool. Ooh. So he probably said something that was like really, really like off limits, like oh my gosh Najee <sighs> Najee terrible y'all Najee so terrible but okay so we're about to throw like a little get together all these people need to change into like their good clothes because we about to have some people come over and we don't need to see y'all in uh underwear or whatever okay so let's go ahead and plan something let's go ahead and do a get together all right we're gonna have Brittany throw it and I guess it's going to be all of everybody else in the household. The twins, Devin, Riri, Anika, oh God, Kenny. Apparently, this is another girl that Darren was flirting with. She's also a drug dealer, so her too. Ooh, the Caliente sisters that I made over. Sarati, Liliana, and Victor, but of course they're made over. Bella, Bella Goff, Sage. I would invite Vanessa, but Vanessa is pregnant. But then again, Anika is coming and Keisha pregnant, so I guess Dawn. 
Lotharia, Iris. Oh my God, the pancake household. So I made them over too. So instead of Eliza, it's now Alana. And instead of Bob, it's Brian. All right, let's just invite him. Okay. So we got 28 people coming. Hopefully they all show up because I don't know, they might not. But of course we're gonna have it here. And now it will be the time. So let's go ahead and do this. Ooh tell a story twerk talk to your friend okay that's cool oh my gosh all right let's let's go up and see who is pulling up to the scene ain't nobody pulling up to the scene yet okay there go judisha what is this baby weight oh baby weight from baby daddy trade someone's been really moody lately plus i don't know how many more cucumber peanut butter tuna fish sandwiches she can make before she just takes a rest i probably stuck a bit I probably stuck a baby in her pregnant wife happy life yeah right you ain't want you don't want the baby oh Najee flip floppy okay so Judisha is here Iris Dina this is supposed to be Dina Caliente Diamond Destiny Heaven Najee Najee yeah. oh uh oh uh oh here go Najee Najee got cray and we got Kenny, always thinking about money, Lord. Okay, so Najee is over here talking to Dina, quote unquote, Trina, Caliente. Uh, Keisha? Okay, ah, what the hell? Somebody get this food up from the middle of the floor. He's gonna go flirt with his girl. Brittany, if you don't mind, come clean this up. Darian is over here talking to Jadisha. Okay, let's come over here and complain about our problems to her. I just feel like I have to watch Najee because Najee, oh my God, Destiny, whatever he does or say, okay, listen, she not even feeling him like that. Whatever he tries to pull on you, don't do it. Where you going? Are you going to talk to Kenny? Not you going to go butt in their conversation. Hello? Why is Brittany down here? Brittany, I understand you trying to make yourself feel better, baby, but I mean, uh, can somebody, I just told somebody to come clean this up. Brittany, come clean this up. Oh, poor thing. Oh, they are just down here talking. Look at Bob. <laughs> Why are you angry, Bob? Why are you so tense? Let's introduce ourselves to Bob. Like, hello, how you doing? I think you understand that we're having a conversation and stuff, but I mean, if you want to join, you could, you could, you know, be cool with. Hey, he's dropping it low, but like, don't do too much because Bob is looking. Like, come on now, don't don't do too much. Can we ask Bob why he's so tense? Like, now he flirting in front of him. Like, please talk about third wheeling. Uh uh, where y'all going? Where are y'all going? Devin and trina oh my god it's not a party unless somebody doing this y'all it's not it's not a party unless somebody doing this anyway let's come back up here oh hey sage oh Brittany and and uh nina Brittany and nina is not getting along uh oh what's going on simmer and rage i don't know what just happened but they just had a negative moodlet so something ain't right but you know what let's see can we come over here and introduce ourselves to keon let's just go introduce ourselves she sees kenny over there gave him a little sad eye hello how you doing oh he don't even want to talk to us i mean it's understandable though like he just got out of an engagement that he did not whoa who is who is arguing over here lily was arguing with somebody iris was I, I, girl are you still mad because iris checked you at her store like as she should have what y'all talking down here about uh y'all can't even really talk because she a whole celebrity and diamond get on my nerves with this inciting cheers thing will she even allow you to like talk to her she probably will because he cute mm -hmm. look i knew it oh why is oh what oh no she got a relationship with keon uh-oh oh gosh y'all this happened too fast too fast they were just introducing themselves to each other and she asked about the peen size uh-oh uh-oh 
What is going on? What just happened? Did I miss something? Why? What? What? Negative? What just happened? Was somebody flirting? Was somebody flirting and got caught? I'm still shocked that she even has a freaking relationship with Najee. Dang, that's it. Okay, Darian just needs to calm his ass down at this point. Um, modern medicine from antibiotics. These antibiotics is giving dairy and nausea. That's the price to pay for improvement. Mm hmm. Oh, what is this? Oh no, she is getting sick, y'all. What baby discussion? I'm all for having a baby. Let's take some time off and take a vacation to Granite Falls, Sulani, or Selva Dorada so we can quality time together. If you know what I mean, what. You asked that to her and you already got a baby? Two of them on the way? Now she about to insult her weed. <laughs> oh my God. Now, they ins now she snapped on him. Miss Seven, her audition is uh, at 9 a.m. What's this? Oh gosh, no, girl. Let's say I love your smile. Darian, I know it's like... I know Valentine's Day is coming up. With a, who are you? Why are you in here? Girl, get out my house. Goodbye. Hello. Like, are you sick? Y'all see, this is what I'm talking about. This was what I was talking about over here. How Keisha just feels like, you know, they still do all these things together. And he still kisses up on her and all this other whoop de doo stuff that she feels like she he still has love for her and you know he ain't going nowhere. Yo, seven, you better not be flirting with him. Seven wants to go to sleep though. She has yeah, she has a uh audition tomorrow. Uh uh Not you hugging him? Oh, they are you arguing with her? Uh-uh. If he does do this, please, Brittany, reject it. Reject it! Period. Period. What you thought this was? What you thought this was? He tried it. Yeah, be embarrassed. <laughs> um, okay. Um, Keisha, can you not walk around with your cooch out? That would be, like, amazing. So, yeah, let's not do that. Uh, Najee, we don't need that thing just swinging all over the place. So, go and, and put your pants. Are we able to? Has to really pee. Oh, listen, I'm gonna leave her alone. She has to really pee. Darian is going to, I guess, cook on the grill. I don't, you know what, stop, stop it. You know what? Don't even cook on the grill. Come over here and make a drink for yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make a drink. Go grab something to drink. You know? Trying to stay calm from feeling furious with someone nearby. Just being around someone that Darian is furious with can be a source of stress. Trying to stay civil is not easy. Well, that's your fault. I don't understand. These men. These men. Keisha, hurry up. I want Keisha to drop these babies already, please. Are you finished? Okay, drink that so nobody takes it. Even in the house, you gotta be cautious because they be stealing drinks. What? You guys, you guys, not right after y'all discuss having a baby, y'all go do something and then do it without protection sis if you are pregnant i will switch to a different household so fast i will go and switch to a different household so fast like don't do this you already see keisha is pregnant by him and then you just broke up with darian for like the main reasons that you you did all this so like you oh my god Brittany, you'd be going backwards. You'd be going backwards. Please don't do this. Don't do this. Oh gosh, she's not pregnant. Good. I was about to say, like, you can't do this. Oh my God, Keisha. I'm so impatient with Keisha. I'm about to have her come down here and work out. <laughs> I'm about to come. No, you can't. Oh no, we need some mods. 
what is this shouldn't you have a license for being that Ooh, girl you got the audacity okay i'm kind of mad because she can't even work out can you do the punching bags oh not you can you do the punching bags you can't even do that can you swim at least skinny dip swim you can't like do laps at all you know what come down here and swim since that's the closest thing you could freaking do Najee I'm gonna need Najee to write some more songs because we need to keep doing these concerts and stuff so go ahead and write some song lyrics what is this I put it down from having wicked whim game rated that sim already know how I body whoa okay <laughs> okay um Oh, oh, she going to her audition. Okay, go to your audition, girl. I hope you get it. Please go to the audition. Y'all, she won't go. I don't want to reset her because if she really won't go, she about to fail this audition, y'all. Let me reset her. Now, now, will you actually go to your audition? Is there something that I can click? Oh, she's not going, y'all. It's a wrap. Girl, you will never be an actor. I, I'm done trying to work with her, y'all. She's not doing it. She's not doing it. She don't want to. She don't really want to be one. She don't really want to be one. She just stood here and did not even go. I don't. Nope. Nope. Anyway, who who wants? Who has some potential in here besides Seven? Because I'm I'm done working with her. Maybe Brittany. Brittany, I'm gonna have you join the career, girl. Now, Missy, if you do the same thing Seven do it's a wrap y'all really i'm only here because i'm just waiting until miss keisha goes into labor honestly so that's the only reason why i'm still here so i will be back when keisha goes into labor oof okay y'all uh my good sis went into labor that was only like i don't know an hour sometime she's in labor and she's going to go eat cake <laughs> But I am going to have her go to the hospital. Look at Najee. Najee's sleeping. He don't even know. Najee, get up. You supposed to be having pre-paternal panic right now. But let's let's uh join her. And we're gonna uh bring Najee with us. I think he's gonna leave though. Like he probably will. But let's go. Okay, so we are here. What? Are oh my god now he popped out with the schlong out please okay so we are here at le hospital naji if you leave i will bring you back real quick so um okay there he is pre paternal panic good you need to go check in are you the doctor how do you check in this has been <laughs> it's been a little minute um check in checking at the front desk oh she changed that's so cute Najee you got a concert but now ain't the time where you going oh you you don't even need to go check in right because you already going into the room can you give me an exclusive not people Najee bring your ass in here so in the comments down below I'm gonna need y'all to leave some girl names in the chat like oh my god is this twitch <laughs> leave some girl names in the comments and stuff because i'm not gonna go with these names that are gonna pop up right here so i want y'all to leave some really 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 pretty names in the comments because she's having two girls did he really leave the room don't throw up now okay it's a girl i forgot they don't have last names so we're just <laughs> we're gonna randomize it three times so that's crystal and um uh, crystal and carly oh lord all right so we got a full household right here and we got a birth certificate we got our twin girls finally my good sis keisha had her babies um this outfit is kind of fire so i might just have her keep it though like I might change the shoes though but the outfit kind of fire but um yeah she got her baby yes let me take a little screenshot not not <laughs> please so the babies are at home and we're gonna go ahead 
and have the both of them go home. I, of course, audition failed. We already knew that. Oh my God, something is wrong. Lightheaded, Keisha is feeling dizzy. Girl, I don't need you dying out here. But where the babies? Okay, they're both up here. They both have no bassinets. Okay, so we got some bassinets in here. So let's go ahead and ooh. Keisha, go shush, Crystal, and Naji. Not Riri. Wasn't y'all like she said, hey Naji, what are you doing? Wanna go do something fun? Um Riri, Naji just had a baby and I pretty sure i could have sworn i told him to go and uh do something about these babies up here so naji come up here and do what she's supposed to do oh i was supposed to say oh my god no but okay uh somebody come over here and, and keep riri company <laughs> see i asked to take a picture i don't know we not trying to be on no fan behavior but she here so oh that's so cute that's cute i like this picture so for the people who are always wondering all you literally have to do is go to google and type in sims 4 selfie cc override and you will find the first thing by Catverse. that is what i have in my game and that is how you get the selfies i will not talk about it anymore because i already put it in like another video so y'all were arguing y'all were doing all that arguing at her at iris's store but y'all are cool like y'all tight but all right y'all so i think it's time for me to go switch to a different household so lego okay you guys so we are in the household with the four iconic women okay and of course anika is pregnant with her boy um she's hungry but oh my gosh darian is is kind of kind of toxic as a baby father but uh where's sarati we need to find sarati a new uh sugar daddy okay that's what we need to do we need to find sarati a new sugar daddy maybe devin because i don't know they seem to have some type of thing going on right here not very big but it's something that can be grown so maybe we could do that uh switch our baby switch our sugar daddy over we need to find a computer i mean we could always have more than one though so it's never it's never nothing oh gosh heaven please okay so we actually you know what let's try and go on a date let's try and go on a date with a really big sugar parent so let's arrange a vip date with a sugar daddy let's see who we got oh vincent vincent is also giving rich vibes oh okay i'm sorry devin but uh heaven i almost caught the place on fire trying to girl you you tried it okay so sobriety come over here and try to arrange a date with vincent Ooh, i hope vincent ain't as toxic because it's like after every after finding out everything about kenny and how he treated her mom and what's been going on and stuff like that sobriety don't want to be around that anymore she don't so she's searching for a new sugar daddy or maybe a sugar mama she could have both like listen we don't discriminate so let's see let's see hopefully it'll work we'll probably go to mm, a restaurant i don't know italian restaurant chipotle or something we'll see okay oh uh sage got her royalties so where are we going restaurant by the sea maybe go to a hookah lounge yeah that's different who is sarati to go on a nice classy dinner date nah we're gonna go straight to the hookah lounge okay so we're here at this brand new hookah lounge okay so this hookah lounge is actually by vixen simmer on youtube um i will leave the link in the description box down below so you guys can go check her out but she built this hookah lounge and it is fire it is fire okay so definitely go and check them check them out check out their other bills that they've made and let's go ahead and introduce ourselves to vincent let's go ahead and say hello how you doing how you doing 
sit and talk to your date, discuss interests. Are we able to say he looks really nice? Like, I love your suit. Can we just say you look really nice? Oh, it worked. Not Kyron. Are you serious? Okay, so it worked. So let's uh, just be subtle. Let's exchange numbers. Hopefully it works and stuff. Oh, all these people coming in. Not he here. Lord. I hope he accepts it. Like, because if you're going to be our sugar daddy, of course we need your number. Like, what? So, are, is it going to work? <gasps> it worked. Let's do a bold pickup line. Oh, they were already going to flirt. Oh, okay. Let me cheat her uh, needs and stuff. <gasps> oh, it worked. Okay. We loved him. Okay. It's kind of cute. I'm not even going to lie. All right. What is this? What's this? Ask about Vincent's views on marriage. Okay, go ahead. You know what? Let's uh let's actually come over here at the bar and talk together. So let's go sit here together. Come on, Vincent. Okay, he's liking what he sees, y'all. That's good. That's good. I'm also gonna be giving them new outfits in the next episode. So in the next episode, you guys will see everybody with some brand new outfits. So let's actually go to Sugar Life and ask about Sugar Partners. Let's make sure he doesn't have any other partners. Go ahead and discuss interest with him. I'm going to need this little Max's match hoe to get out our business. That's what I'm going to need. Okay, so let's go ahead and ask him how much money do you make? Because these little Sugar, part sugar Life dates be going by too fast for me in my humble opinion so i don't want to brag but i can have anything i want or anyone Ooh, i like that i like that that's what we like to hear dang we can't come on now like let's go ahead and flirt it up oh he is tense what made you so tense all of a sudden i'm trying to figure out what made him so tense all of a sudden Okay, we got some flirty relationship going. Oh, he's married. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um, but apparently he's still interested. So let's ask him to be our sugar daddy before this date is over. Do you want to be our sugar daddy? Yes. So he's our sugar daddy now. That's good. So let's go ahead and uh-uh uh-uh you no 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 you better give us our daily allowance before you go at least dang two thousand Woo. okay Ooh, ask about size okay so like listen can we get our the rest of our stuff if that's okay with you sir Oh, we can't. Okay, that's cool. What she asked about his size, child? Let that man go home, girl. It's the uh, trifling people passed out, like, with his butt all out for me. Like, trifling. Take advantage. Take advantage. I hope this nasty dude or this nasty dude don't come near us and just do anything. Because, uh-uh, we rejecting them too. We rejected them too, Cornelius and Dominic, cause y'all stink. Uh, -uh y'all two getting rejected. I don't care. You don't deserve my money. Okay, boob service. Oh, she's feeling it. Ew. Okay, who's that? Who's that? That's him. Why y'all running? Old lady. Rama Magic girl. I've seen way better hoes than you. Wow. Ew, rejecting. We're rejecting. Fuck that. Okay, so I think we are good. So we're going to have her be the first fan, Eva. So go ahead and seduce her. Oh, you could seduce her into more. Okay, do that. Did it work? Oh, it worked. All right. We better have gotten paid a lot of money for this. It better not be no $100 that's what i'm talking about okay 2500 i could do that okay homegirl right here even a mixologist wow oh why are everybody looking at her funny what did she do ew these two. Oh, that's why i don't think we have any more customers the mixologist but it won't let me like it'll just say reject her oh oh she's a customer she's a customer okay it was a lot of girls yes girl don't nobody care she's just mad because her wig's stale that's all 
She just mad because her wig's still and she ain't got no edges. Too bad. Okay, y'all. So, we are finished and we made $8,000 tonight. So, let's go and put that put that money in our freaking account. So, put that there. So, she got 18 k so far. So, go ahead and go home, Sarati. You've done enough for today. We got to check on Anika and everybody else in the house. Screw him because he said, oh, well. All right, y'all. So, we're back home with Sarati and my good sis, Anika. Girl, I would advise you actually to not sit in here on this uh, chair knowing what Sarati has been doing and here uh let me get her some light shampoo okay put that in there all right uh sis come in here you gotta take a shower that's not gonna work where's the other bathroom where's the other do we not have a shower like do we not have a shower that's a half bathroom okay anika come over here take a quick shower so you can get rid of these uh crabs I can just imagine her being pregnant and then she got these crabs and then her belly is just getting bigger and bigger so she can't even like ho oh, poor ting poor ting poor ting poor ting i gotta change her outfit too i gotta give her a maternity fit at some point but what trimester are you in she's about to be in her third trimester in 19 hours okay go ahead use that medicine okay sage had a eureka moment uh sage where you at girl all right so sage is you know what sage come in here and practice your oh you know what you could do you can actually come in here and hack something hack kenny's little funds and stuff go hack his stuff see how much money we could get from that heaven girl why are you walking around with no pants on oh my god my good sis got her whole coochie out on the chair like please heaven please how long have you been walking around like this oh i feel bad for these sisters but honestly i want heaven to get a man because i feel like she should have a man she should have a man at some point so you know what you know what oh she's disgusted from all this food that's not good so go ahead and clean that up gross from cleaning up sort of food her squeamish trait is acting up right now but okay heaven is not heaven um sage is hacking something from kenny that she learned about remember she hacked his info before he left so she is looking more into it and hopefully it works and she actually steals some money from kenny <laughs> imagine if she does like girl we going to jail <laughs> Is it gonna work? $83. Not $83. Girl, we is not going to jail for no $83. Try again. Try the Lothario Trust Fund. <laughs> Try again, girl. Anika keeps getting on this computer. I'm gonna have her use it in a good way. Okay, I guess you could participate in pregnancy forms. I, I don't know what else to tell you. It's her with this posing for me in front of the dishwasher. Y'all, I think after Sage hacks into the Lothario Trust Fund, we're gonna send Heaven on like, uh, have her go to like a love seeking event and see like who she could find like as a date. Because honestly, that's what everybody's thinking. Everybody's thinking like, mom, you need a man, okay? I understand you trying to help push my relationship not relationship push my career up there but you need a man do you want any more kids do you want any more kids uh mom let's ask her that do you want any more kids i'm open to that okay so if you open to the idea then you still young and shining mama you you better go find somebody before you get caught with sage is almost done let's see how many how much money she can get out of this y'all if it's more than a thousand oh wow these people are brokeity broke <laughs> these trust funds are brokeity broke you know what i'm gonna have her practice her program and let me cheat her needs 
Destiny is wondering if I wanted to go over to her house and hang out. So does that mean like you want to take pictures of us? Is that what's going on? Because like if that's not the case, then then there's no point. Uh, Destiny invited us over to her house. I don't know why. I don't know what's up. Maybe she wants to take pictures or something, but um, hopefully that's the case. Oh, okay. Have feminine photo taken by taken by Destiny. So we're gonna go ahead and hopefully that works. That'd be cute. Have a have Destiny take photos and stuff of her because I'm pretty sure that's the only reason why she invited us over because we do want to take some pictures before you give birth. I wonder where's Diamond. Let's get these pictures done. Oh, that's cute. Okay, Anika, I see you styling and profiling. So let's do uh, something like this so you can see everything. And then the baby bump is right there. How cute. And then let's have her do another one because hello we need as many as possible and then destiny needs them for like her portfolio and stuff and these are nice shots like right here like in front of the palm trees and stuff oh she got down on the floor with that baby girl don't hurt yourself you you look like you straining your neck but i'll let you be so i'm just gonna take this okay you know what let's do one more let's do one more by the way y'all i'm doing this using the road to fame mod so nothing new okay but let's do one more and nika was like i didn't really like that one girl girl not your arm in your girl no oh my god anika girl you know d okay y'all we're done with photos <laughs> we're done with the photos that was cute thank you for inviting us over to take pictures this was great okay she is getting hot we don't need her burning to death so let's go ahead and go home y'all and then let's see what we could do about heaven and this cute speed dating thing we could figure out all right y'all so anika is back home all right so miss heaven miss heaven all right y'all let's go plan an event right now let's add an event and let's do like a love finder maybe love seeker heaven you know what let's go to this small little hookah lounge in the cut and let's do right now okay so we're here uh hopefully some cool people show oh girl calm it down hopefully some good looking men pull up how are you supposed to know if like they're here uh for this are y'all here oh speed day okay i got you i got you well i mean men women i don't know what heaven is interested in okay <laughs> but we'll find out tonight so this is a hookah lounge i'm going to put links in the description box at least to the pages because i'm pretty sure this is on patreon not darian is here I no you not here for speed dating. No you not here for speed dating. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Uh oh, he started talking to her, y'all. Oh lord. Let's ask him about his age. How old are you? And stuff cuz we grown, baby. We grown grown. I'm a young adult. Okay, you look like okay. Early 20s, mid 20s, that's cool. Mama is in like her mid thirties and stuff, so I don't know. This could be like a cougar type of thing. Well, let's give him a heartfelt compliment. Um, who else can be a potential interest? Maybe her, Anaya. Oh no, she married. We can't do nothing with her. Uh, I don't know who that is. Katarina. What's this with this blue hair? Who do you? Chloe. You know what? I kind of see two potential people. Let's introduce ourselves to katarina because honestly whoever else she is interested in here uh we'll give them a makeover because you know we don't do maxes here go introduce yourself to her she's pretty anyway a makeover wouldn't even be bad so we got two potentials we got darian and we got katarina so we're gonna introduce ourselves to her and we're gonna put the both of them in a group okay so let's actually come over here and sit and try together let's all go sit and try to hookah together 
and just chill and get to know one another and who i don't know i guess whoever she likes more that's who she'll pursue more but for now this is just what she doing oh she don't like it girl try it what are you doing oh my god the mood lady from smoking strong hookah i haven't smoked the hookah in forever okay maybe that's a lie but it never hit me like this before it's weed in here you know they got that dank where i'm from didn't think folks was pushing it like this over here okay okay heaven <laughs> oh girl okay i don't know why they switch seats but uh we're gonna keep going unwind together she is just not here for the bull like oh she is just not yeah she not here for it let's make a flirtatious joke to darian darian tried it at least like dang oh he got the fresh pink set i see you let's ask about his career what do you do for a living she seems too stuck up for me in my opinion oh she even leaving like but who's this too who are you what's your name bryce let's introduce ourselves to him too we gotta keep our options open you know we gotta keep them open so let's uh take her out the group put him in it bryce it's the pink set for me but okay oh he tried it at least oh girl your little stuck up ass let's talk to darian a little more cheat her needs and stuff and it's so sad that he does <laughs> this is so messy because mama don't even know that this is her daughter's baby father oh we gotta stop we gotta stop this is not cool this ain't cool we gotta stop y'all i just realized i just remember that this is her daughter's baby father but she don't know that though <laughs> she just know that she got pregnant oh gosh y'all oh no oh no they just all intertwine and just with each other and just sleeping with one another and doing this and doing that with one another this is just nasty it's just the fact that she doesn't know that this is her daughter's baby father oh my god they just keep flirting oh no why does it always lead to that why does it always lead to that y'all just met y'all just met stop it y'all just met oh god oh my god y'all oh no oh no 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 oh no okay oh gosh the fact that they just met oh no can i join in not dark dreamer fine that dark dreamer wanted to join in child how did you even know something was going down heaven when i said like go on a speed dating thing this what the f oh, no! oh my god heaven oh my god mom this is so embarrassing what the f oh my gosh mom please please this is not this is not oh, okay <laughs> yo who are you you didn't even introduce yourself to us i swear one more person join in i'm ending this episode one two three four five oh my god one two three four five that's five people y'all one more person eggs this episode is getting deleted like okay not delete <gasps> y'all i'm done i'm done i'm done i'm ending i'm ending i'm ending and then this is her daughter's baby daddy that's seven people no <laughs> that's so old. i'm ending the episode the, oh, he ran over there y'all that is seven people one count with me count with me one two three four five six seven y'all 
when they go home this episode is getting ended i'm so sorry that was too much that's too much that's too much i don't think anybody else is gonna join after this heaven heaven please what do you even call this that's seven people in one session what do you call that y'all she going outside this poor bartender this poor bartender like this was honestly a lot please don't have the okay at least she doesn't have the take a pregnancy test option but heaven that that was really crazy okay that was really crazy you just let six men get up in there like and one of them was your daughter's baby father but you didn't know that though gosh go home go home we have to end this episode we have to end this episode this is too much i am done <laughs> i am stressed i am i'm going through secondhand embarrassment for heaven heaven is officially for the streets and you know what that's gonna be the name of this video <laughs> that's gonna be the name of this video okay she for the streets oh not britney pregnant hold on i'm nosy by who jay huntington dang okay congrats sis okay y'all we are done we're done here we're done here i am overwhelmed heaven uh, i'm completely overwhelmed i i truly did not think that was gonna happen by her going to a speed dating event that was definitely some speed dating if i do say so myself but oh my gosh y'all if y'all are still here at the end of this video i let me know say something in the comments put a heart put a put something okay because this was a lot hopefully this is over an hour long of content for y'all because i know y'all been asking for longer videos and i'm trying to deliver but it's so hard to keep them long when there's like pauses in the middle of the freaking video so if this video hits over an hour long make sure you leave a like okay because i struggled editing this I, i'm pretty sure if you like this video don't forget to go ahead and like comment and subscribe and turn on my post notifications so that way you won't miss a single episode in the near future and i will go ahead and see you guys in my next video bye <music>